A lot of fellow parents tell me that they find it really hard to get their children to even consider trying salad. But there are a few things you can do to encourage kids to eat salad because once they start to like it, you can put it in their lunches, you can serve it to them as their vegetable with dinner, and they get pretty excited about it. So firstly, you can buy these little cucumbers. You can take them with you to the market and do the shopping for the lettuce and choose a different color or a different kind of lettuce. Just give them the choice. Or if you have even a small patch of ground, you can plant a few cucumber plants or some tomato plants, depending on what the climate's like where you live. And the kids will get so excited to go out into the garden and pull one of these out. And then they'll be more likely to try it. Now, I used to buy salad dressings in a bottle from the store, but then I read the label of those salad dressings and there were so many ingredients in there, many of which I couldn't even pronounce. And I thought to myself, I'm gonna make my own salad dressings. It'll be cheaper, it'll be healthier, and it's really easy to do. So once a week, I make a container like this full of salad dressing and I use it through the week. And it takes two seconds to make. Let's just do this together. I'm just gonna get some olive oil and some vinegar. This is white balsamic vinegar. There's also dark balsamic vinegar, or you can use white wine vinegar if you like that, or apple cider vinegar. And then you just need any kind of olive oil. And you basically just add all your ingredients in here. I'm starting with a bit of garlic. You don't need a lot of garlic, but for a whole week's worth of salad dressing, one small clove like this. And then we're gonna add our vinegar. Remember, this is for a whole week, so I'm making a lot of salad dressing. My lemon to add a little bit of sour taste to it. My hand is gonna be kind of like my high-tech citrus juicing machine. I'm gonna add some honey because honey is gonna take the edge off of the lemon and the vinegar a bit. It looks like a lot, but it's for a whole week's worth of salad dressing. So it's not too much. Bit of salt, some pepper if you like. You don't have to put it in. And you can also chop any kind of herbs that you like. If you're a dill fan or a parsley fan, chop it up and put it in there. And then the thing you're gonna top it up with is olive oil. And you probably wanna put in almost as much olive oil as vinegar. Olive oil actually helps your body to absorb the vitamins in, in lettuce and in green vegetables. So maybe that's why they put it in salad dressing. And that's it. You're gonna close it up like this and shake. And then this whole thing can go in your fridge. But first, I just wanna taste it because I might need to add a little bit more salt. Mm. Could use more salt. That's my salad dressing for the week.